Welcome back to Why Thing. Dear friends, nature has given animals some body parts so that they can defend themselves, get food, and look cool. But sometimes those same body parts can hurt an animal so badly that it can easily lose its life. How exactly? Be sure to watch this episode to the end. We'll make it for you. Number one, Buru Bari Rusa tells. This is a Babi Rusa or deer pig. It belongs to the swine family but looks like a deer with tusks instead of antlers. The mammal is native to a few Indonesian islands. The tusks give a Babi Rusa a remarkable prehistoric appearance. However, only males have prominent canine tusks. The tusk pierces the flesh of its snout, growing upward and curving backward toward its forehead. The lower canine tusks also grow upward. The upper tusks have developed a shielding, protective function, whilst the lower tusks are offensive and dagger-like. As the upper tusks do not hone the lower canines as in other suits, the babarusa male actively sharpens its lower tusks on trees. Where parents on the tusks suggest that main lane babarusa use the upper tusks to interlock and hold their opponent's lower tusks during combat. The tusks are also factors that increase the coolness in the male babarusa in front of the female. For these sexy females, the longer and the curvy tusks are, the more impressive. But babarusa shouldn't be smitten because these unusual fans not only make the babarusa look weird but endanger its own survival. Although the tusks have a protective function, they are also a weapon that can kill them at any time. Baby rooster must constantly sharpen the tusk, because if a baby rooster does not grin this tusk, they keep growing to the point where they can enter its own skull. Number 2. Reindeer Horn The male reindeer possesses a set of antlers that can reach more than 2 meters wide and weigh around 36 kilograms. This is an impressive head ornament, also a powerful weapon for them to endure enemies. During mating season, the male reindeer will use its antlers to participate in fights for females with other males and these battles usually end when either is injured or killed. However, because the antlers have many curved branches, when the deer guys show their strength, this action can make them easily clutched together so tightly that they can deal with this situation by themselves leading to a sad ending. They cannot stand up, cannot eat, drink, and eventually lead to death, both. Sometimes the animals are very lucky because people notice their misery in time. It's enough to cut out a couple of antlers and shoot them off. Number 3. Sloth Slowness Sloths are one of the mammals with slowest speed and living habits on the planet. Sloth movement is an evolution for the safety of this animal. When unable to see, they can only slowly crawl step by step, carefully senses their surroundings so they don't fall on a tree. Not only that, but being slow also has many benefits for sloths. First, they save a huge amount of energy. They use only 90% of the average energy of the mammal. Second, being slow helps the sloth avoid being easily spotted by the predators that focus on the movement of the prey such as jaguars or eagles. However, this slowness sometimes takes the life of the sloths because although most of them live in trees, once a week they go to the ground to relieve themselves. The action seems usual but extremely risky for the sloths because 40 to 60% of the sloths will be eaten by predators or hit by a car when crossing the street during this time. Number 4. Donkey Hooves Donkey needs manicures. I'm not kidding. Like horses, most donkeys need their hooves cut at certain intervals. It's usually every 6 to 10 weeks, you got it right. Horses are subjected to this procedure as well. If their hooves aren't cut, the animal loses its ability to walk straight, which causes trauma, discomfort, and shock to everyone who sees the bent hooves because it's a really creepy sight. I wonder how wild donkeys deal with that. 
There are so few wild donkeys left that I guess hooves would be the least of their problems. Number 5. Sheep fur Over the past few centuries, humans have created species that are beneficial to agriculture and it has caused quite a bit of controversy, especially when it comes to sheep. Human bred sheep for wool. Though dusmatic sheep grow a lot of wool, and this wool will grow year round. The sheep wool brings an extremely high economic benefit to humans. It means that sheep will be protected and cared for a long time by humans. They won't worry about hunger, don't worry about the cold, don't worry about being killed by birders, because humans already take care of these things. But these won't become what kill sheep when they are not taken care of by humans. If humans don't cut it in time, it can end very badly. The wool is long and dense, it will be a bad option in hot weather because it will lead to heat stress and die. If the sheep with long wool lays down on the step slope, it can roll over from its back. In that time, the sheep will look like a bug that lies with the leg up in the air. In addition, the thick wool also causes vision problems, and it also makes sheep to be attacked by ticks, bugs, bacteria, and fungi. In addition, the weight of the coat also makes the legs of the sheep unstable and vulnerable. Number 6. A Garlic Horn Things are much worse for a garlic. These wild rams are considered the largest and can weigh over 100 pounds and look quite menacing, especially if you look at their large, strong, coarse screw-shaped horns which arguably protect themselves from predators and to fight for females. However, despite their majestic appearance, the fate of these wild rams is sometimes tragic. The horns, which are meant to be a powerful weapon of self-defense, can lead the animal to a slow and painful death. The older the Argali gets, the more likely it is that their horns will begin to grow in the wrong direction and eventually pierce the ram's faces slowly and painfully. They will penetrate deeper and deeper until they result in death either from the infection or anyway, you get the idea. Number 7. Turtle Shell Okay, if deers, rams, and other ungulates seem to be very unlucky in life, then there must be some species that got some bonuses from nature. Toto, for example. They live a long life, don't rush anywhere, and are well protected from predators by a tough shell. I thought so too, until I found out that turtles have one bug. They can roll over if they're on their back. A helpless turtle can be killed by the sun, starvation, or foam prey for predators. Turtles are especially vulnerable. Their rigid armor doesn't bend with body movement, which of course complicates the flipping process. They often fight and try to turn the rival over on the back, and it would seem that large individuals clearly have an advantage, but once the big turtle loses, it'll never get up on its paws again. Nature is a huge challenge for animals, right? It is a list of dangerous animal body parts that can kill them. If there are missing animals in this list, please let us know in the comments. Thank you.